A month and a day after the murders of two Delphi teens, police say they're still no closer to making an arrest in that case. Now, they're still taking new tips in the case, but the number of investigators taking those tips is diminishing. Tonight, our Rich Van Wyk is in Delphi, and he has the status of the effort to bring justice for Libby German and Abby Williams. Four weeks into this double homicide investigation, there are fewer police officers now working the case. Departments that lent officers to the investigation for weeks have now said we need them back in our own communities to combat and solve local crimes. Even with the decrease in manpower, police say more than 70 officers were at this morning's briefing waiting for their daily assignments. At last count, they had more than 2,000 leads to check out. Leads to the identity of this man, a man they believe abducted and participated in the murders of Libby German and Abby Williams. The best friends were taken from a popular hiking trail and killed in a secluded wooded area. Police are getting about 200 new tips every day. That is far fewer than when the investigation began. We know that that number is going to fall off. Uh, the interest is going to fall off a little bit. The state police sergeant also expected the 20 police departments and agencies that sent officers here to help would eventually need them back. Departments from all over the state of Indiana and also some of the national departments have come here and helped us out. We know that that, that resource is going to start dropping off and it has already started. Uh, some of the departments say, you know, we've, we've given you new X amount of people for so many days, we're going to have to get back on it and, and do our job too. The community continues to support police with cards of encouragement. Thank you for your strength and bravery. Thank you for your work and dedication. Be strong. Good will prevail and the evil will not win. Police insist they are making progress by eliminating many potential suspects. They're also double and triple checking other suspects. At the same time, they're looking for that one tip, John, that connects them to that man in that all-familiar fuzzy photo. Yeah, let's hope they find it. Thank you, Rich Van Wyk and Delphi tonight. Maybe you're the one that has a tip, and if you know anything that you think could solve the murders of Libby and Abby, here's the number to call. It's 844-459-5786. We have that posted along with the tip email address at WTHR.com and on the WTHR app.